Hi, my name is Robin Lee. I'm 17 years old, and I've been playing Deeds since I was six. Deeds is the Chinese bamboo flute. It's one of the most well-known Chinese instruments, and it comes in different sizes and keys. It's a wind instrument that's played horizontal, just like the western flute. But instead of buttons, there's just six holes cut out for the fingers. I got started on Deeds through my mom's friend, whose daughter also played Deeds. The friend introduced a flute teacher to me, and since I didn't know anything about this instrument, I started learning it out of curiosity. For the most part, I play Deeds more as a hobby. Lessons were pretty short and only about once a week. But what was really surprising is how hard it was to learn something I thought was going to be really simple. I had a lot of trouble with really basic techniques like holding my breath to play a long note. That's when I really learned the importance of patience and perseverance, even if it's to master something that seems really easy. I've always been really shy growing up, and I hated being in front of people. It always took a long time to build enough confidence to do something in front of people. But playing deeds was one of those things that finally helped me overcome this fear. First time I really felt rewarded was in fifth grade, where I entered a music competition, and I was with my team of my classmates. I still remember being really nervous and didn't think we did that well. But I was really surprised that we actually won third place. After that, even though I didn't think we did a good job, I was kind of frustrated that we didn't win first, and that started pushed me to practice more. So hopefully, we can do better and win next time. Since I went to school in China, there was a lot of homework, and I had less and less time to practice. I really struggled trying to decide whether I can continue or not. And in sixth grade, I had to stop deeds since school was taking up all of my time. But it was a hard decision. Finally, in ninth grade, my family moved here to America, and I thought I could finally pick up deeds again. But for a while, I struggled with transitioning to school here. I had to catch up with my studies and learn as much as English as I can. But as soon as I felt ready, I started these lessons again. And it felt like learning everything all over. I was back to struggling with basic techniques because I hadn't practiced in a long time. But this time, I really wanted to try to hold on to this skill and improve on it. My teacher now is really strict about the techniques of deeds, and I get yelled at a lot. But I think that's good. It helps me stay focused on improving myself. Playing deeds again reminded me how much dedication I needed if I really wanted to hold on this time. Within a year, I began performing on stage. Thankfully, I was less nervous and actually enjoyed being on stage. What's really surprising is seeing how people here in America also enjoy the music I played. I performed on a lot of different venues, from the big outdoor events to the smaller volunteer performances. In 2017, I took the Central Conservatory Chinese Instrument Grade Exam. It is certified by the top music school in China. I passed level 9, and then in 2018, I passed level 10, which is the highest level. In the summer of 2019, I joined a group of my musician friends on a summer camp in China. It's a music and art summer camp, and the main mission is doing charity performances for the locals in all the places we visited. We went to retirement communities, school for kids with disabilities, and a lot of children's schools that were in the poor and rural regions. 
we not only interacted and performed for them, but also donated some living necessities as well. Playing these for the audience in China really made me proud of sticking with what I'm learning. It really opened me up to a lot of opportunities and gave me a lot of experience as a music learner. I'm definitely more confident in myself than how I was a few years back. In 2019, I entered the Huayue Cup International Competition, which is the second competition I entered since 5th grade. This competition was a lot harder to win since I was going against people from all over the world. I felt more confident, but I think my nerves still got to me and I got second place. Obviously, I wish I could have done better, but seeing that there has been some improvement is encouraging to me, and I want to keep going. One of my favorite songs right now is called New Shepherd's Song. It's also a song that I've been working on for over a year. This is one of those pieces that really challenges me, not only in the technical side, but also my experience and knowledge on the music itself. I'm still struggling to really get it down, since it requires a lot of discipline and patience to understand and play it well. On the side, I've picked up other Chinese wind instruments as well. The xiao, hulu si, and pan pipes. But these is still my main instrument. The experience I gained from playing these showed me a lot of opportunities that I hope to keep exploring. I want to get better and perform more. I'm proud to spread awareness of this part of my culture and I'll keep working hard.